Economic Finance uh, Crime Commission, EFCC, or Lao Lukore Day, has stressed the need for Nigerian youth to see themselves as agents of positive change and have a lot to contribute to the socio-economic development of the nation. Speaking at the second edition of the Leadership Trend, a trainings program in Abuja, he said he, who was represented by the Head Enlightenment and Reorientation Unit EFCC, Aisha Mohammed, said the Commission's dream is to see the youth contribute meaningfully to the society, emphasizing on the need to work together in bringing positive change to the society. The Economic and Financial Crimes Commission boss declared the readiness of his agency to work with all stakeholders including the youth towards changing the narrative and repositioning the country to greater exploit. Of the EFCC, Mr. Ola Olukayo, they always say this, Nigeria is the only country we have. Nobody can come and fix it for us. We all have to come together and fix Nigeria. So, and that's the message to the youth. They should all come together. They are actually the future of the country. So they need to come together now. We have to fight it together to salvage Nigeria. So that's my message to them. They should come and let's put hands together and fight corruption. The EFCC is actually very, very keen when it comes to the youth because we know they are the future. So the EFCC has um, integrity clubs in primary and secondary school because we want to catch them young. And uh, the parts and parcel of the program being organized by this kind of uh, initiative, zero tolerance for all these social vices. When you say zero tolerance, uh, you move away out of it totally. And of course they should realize that indulging in it we prevent them from attaining their destiny in life. All the speakers at the event, including the chairperson Zero Tolerance for Social Immoralities Initiative Africa, Razak Jeje, called on all stakeholders to join hands in collective pursuit of empowering new generation of leaders to curb the rising tides of social vice among Nigerian youth. The chairperson Zero Tolerance for Social Morality's Initiative Africa made the call while addressing journalists at the second edition of its leadership trainings program in Abuja. He said the training was aimed to, to imitate uh, student leaders with uh, knowledge and insights that would help them drive positive change and become exemplary leaders by their respective spheres. <laughs> 